Peter. You guys ever see a uh, hook? Mm -hmm. It's day seven of the vlog. Uh, we've already been driving for how long? A long time. Two and a half hours. Two and a half hours. Three hours. Two and a half, three hours. Uh, and we've got six hours left because we had to go to the Best Buy because the stupid butthead stole my camera out of the car with my charger and my battery. So we finally were able to find a Best Buy because apparently there's like one Best Buy in the entire state of Wyoming. Maybe two. No, there's, no. A, few, there's a couple. Spread out. Yeah, there's, they're, they're in, there's a couple in Colorado. But we had passed them when it was the Best Buys were closed. So we couldn't go backward. We had to go forward. So now it's 2.38. Uh, we're going to find something quick to eat, uh, possibly. And then we are headed to Yellowstone. Uh, I'm not sure exactly what's going to happen at Yellowstone because here's the deal. But when you get to Yellowstone, the um, everything is already booked up. It's like the pre-booked stuff. Like when even when we tried a few weeks ago to get spots, we couldn't. So we have to do the first come first serve. But by the time we get there in six hours, uh, the office is going to be closed. So, um, and if it's, wait, is it closed? Possibly. Possibly. It might be closed. And if it's not closed, chances of us getting a campsite tonight are like zero. So we're kind of going back and forth between sleeping in the car or sleeping in a hotel. We're I not sure really, exactly really what we're going to do. I don't really care what we do because I like sleeping in a hotel and I like sleeping in the car. So yeah. We've got our sleeping in the car system at this point, which is kind of cool. John, where do you want to sleep tonight? You want to sleep in the car or you want to sleep in the hotel? I personally would rather get a hotel, but we'll see what happens. Sleeping in the car. I don't really care. Well, we'll see what happens. Daddy, what do you want to do? You don't care? I don't know. Okay, so we'll find out later what we end up doing. But we're very excited to finally make it to Yellowstone, driving all the way from Maryland. It's been a long drive. And uh, we're finally at our Look, furthest west point, which is Yellowstone. We're almost there. You know, he's talking about the little, I don't know if you can see There's him. two yellow squishy guys. <laughs> the little. The wiggly guys. The wiggly guys, guys yeah. So we will see you in a little while and we'll update you then. Hello. Okay, so we're back with the updates. Uh, so it looks like we are going to get to Yellowstone about 945, ooh, which is ooh, very, very ooh. late. We looked at some of the hotels in the area. They're all booked up except for two. Um, the cheapest one is $333 a night. So we decided we're gonna sleep in our car tonight. Um, it's gonna be a lot easier that way. We'll be able to get up and go to the, get to the front of the line for getting a campsite. So that'll be good. Um, and hopefully we'll have good luck with that. Um, it's not my favorite option, but with no hotels, available anywhere near there <laughs> what else are we gonna do you know um uh, the kids are getting used to sleeping in the car they've been sleeping in the car for a few hours uh, a couple of nights so it's really just me and john kind of getting used to sleeping in the car but we have pillows and blankets we have our sleeping bags so we should be fine but they're gonna be that long really because we're gonna get there late and we have to get up stupid early to be at the park so right. Right, so it's only going to be like about seven hours or so that we're parked, yeah. something like that. So, you know, it's all good. It's definitely not my favorite arrangement, but you do what you got to do. So, car sleeping it is, but the kids are doing good. Yeah, I like They're chilling. Sleeping. Yeah, Lila likes sleeping in the car. I hate. I'm used to it. <laughs> this is really cool about the Midwest. Let me show you this. This is really one. We're not even in the Midwest anymore. We're like in the West now. Uh, I don't have Wyoming standing in the Midwest, but you can see the storms coming down. So you see the white part, and then the gray is the actual rain coming down in the distance. So if you look over this way, you can see that those are the storms that we're kind of going into, and you can see the bands of rain over there. It's kind of crazy. because I've never seen this, because there's no open spaces like this around us, so it's kind of cool, man. It's pretty neat. Hey, that Does it really? That's yeah. amazing. All right. So we'll check in with you guys in a little while. Thank goodness for rest stop playgrounds. <laughs> it's pretty awesome to be able to stop at this. This is called, I don't know what rest, whether this rest stop even has a name. I don't know if they have names out here. 
the Jersey ones all have names, but it's kind of cool that they have a little spot where they can just play for a few minutes. So we had a little minor mishap in that we got pulled over for speeding because my husband is such a speeder. He was going 78 in a 70 mile per hour zone. Law breaker. 78 and a 70. That's true. You want some bread for so, a sandwich? Yeah, sounds good. So, uh, yeah. So we got we just got a warning, which makes us really happy. I think that the police officer was just trying to get us to be safe, you know, like just trying to warn us about the roads, like knowing we were from out of town. He seemed like a nice dude. Uh, so right now we're pulling over. We're having like a snacky kind of dinner because we need to keep going. So we're making some of our camp sandwiches. Um, and then we might heat up some of our um, rations that we got from uh, REI, our outdoor rations, when we get there as dinner. Um, we have a camp stove so we can boil some water and, and heat up some of those for dinner. Uh, it's going to be an interesting night. <laughs> I'm looking forward to actually getting a campsite tomorrow. Cross your fingers for us. Oh, I'm hoping the we here is absolutely incredible. Jackalope exhibit! <laughs> <That's a bad. laughs> Lila's riding on the jackalope. He's so big. He is big. I can barely even get off on it. <laughs> is it fun riding on the jackalope? Uh -huh. Supposedly there's a better jackalope inside. You want to go check it out? Sure. All right. So you totally save a <laughs> John, will you spot him on the other side? There you go. You are on a jackalope. But, but does, does, it, does it do anything? No, it's jackalope. Huh? You it's sit on dead. him. <laughs> like, it's like, dead. like, does you put money inside of him? Then no, it does some, no. No, then, honey. Then what's the point of why they want you to go on? Because it's so cool. Because it, it looks cool. cool. Because it's a jackalope, man. It's, it's super so cool. Big. Where else are you going to ride a jackalope? Doesn't have to be powered to be cool. Yeah. No, it does. It doesn't do anything. You just use it. All right, Lila, go ahead up. You take a turn. There you go. Ride him, cowgirl. Ride the jackalope. It's so high up, though. Yeah, he's super high. John, no, no, honey. Super high up. All right, you want me to get down? There you go. Very cool. All right. Now John's on the jackalope. I'm gonna get back. Father, father, father. Hold on tight, don't fall off. He likes that one better for some reason. You like this jackalope better than yeah, the other one? Because it has horns. Oh. And, and there's steps on it. And yeah. it didn't like have a big jackalope. holder. Yeah, I like the big holder. And it didn't, and it wasn't a rabbit. That's not a rabbit. And it it looks kind of like a rabbit though, doesn't it? Yeah. Like a rabbit with horns. Hold I on like, tight, please. I like the one inside better because it was a real jackalope. And this it, is like, a real jackalope. Super too. soft. Mm -hmm. And it was high up at the end of the This is cool. a real jackalope, too. All right, let me get you down, buddy. We gotta keep going. No! Castle. Insane. Any bears yet? No bears yet. The water's making it worse, buddy. John has a tummy ache. I'm not dehydrated. You don't think you're dehydrated? No, I'm making I'm doing my vlog. You're vlogging? Yeah, I'm vlogging. It's really cool. See that? Let's see if I can zoom in. <gasps> Is that? You guys see that? Yeah, There's buddy. Those snow. Those snow. Snow on them. Yeah. Look at look at them. They're touching the they're touching the clouds. It's so cool. How cool take, that is. Who wants to take a video? Look. Look at pretty. the sky, guys. It's purple. So that's what the sun sets like. Uh huh. Mm, yeah, yeah sometimes it can be. Purple. I wish I could eat the sky. <laughs> See the mountains through there? Like there you go. Uh, they have snow on them. Isn't that cool? Right here. 
here we go. That's the shot right there. That That's the shot. Is that snow or is it water? Wow. And look over there. That's snow. Wow. <laughs> I feel a very Blair Witch Project right now. So we found a campsite, super excited. Basically, the people that were here, the neighbors said that they left when it started raining. So their loss, our gain, we have a campsite at Yellowstone. Yes! So we're gonna go ahead and set up now. Yay! Hello, my friends. It is the end of day seven. We got our camp set up. I don't know if you can see it. You probably can't see it. It's so dark. And it's after lights out. So I can't really talk any louder than this but it ended up being a pretty great day and uh yeah we're all settled so we're going to bed so i'll see you in the morning for yellowstone yeah <laughs> so excited it's so epic. i know right look it's so creepy looking it. there you are <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> good night everybody or good day or good night bye